All right, got my IMI Magnum Research Desert Eagle here again. I'm gonna try some different ammo this time. Got some uh, Bitterroot Valley, um, 180 grain bear load hollow points. So I'm gonna try them out. I've had them for a while, but I was gonna try them in my revolver. Never did, so I figured I'd give them a shot. That's what they look like. So. I'll give you a good look at my Desert Eagle too. So, hold on a second. Put this down a minute. There. So, that's this thing. It's a early model, probably first year run. I'm not sure what they went up to the first year, but the serial number is pretty low. Uh, supposedly they start out at 3,000, this one's 6614, so pretty early. It's got the optional millet sights, adjustable, and they're a lot better. I got a 44 Magnum Desert Eagle, and it's got the standard sights on it, and can't hardly see them, so these are nice, definitely worth the money, extra money, so... All right, that's my Desert Eagle, and I'm gonna aim for the the left lung this time. So give it a shot, see what happens. Yeah, look, that works pretty good. Right. Yep, all empty. A little shot pretty good. And I don't know, I don't know if it's me or, uh, I'm just getting used to the 357, the Desert Eagle, but uh, I shot better with that than the uh, the Privy stuff I shot earlier. I uh, I shot some uh, Privy with this stuff earlier, and the uh, head that was a little bit more all over, and that's the uh, Bitterroot Valley stuff. So kind of surprised with that, but that's cool. Looks like that's some pretty good stuff. So. All right, it's my uh, Desert Eagle 57 Magnum with the uh, shooting the uh, Bitterroot Valley ammunition. Looks like that stuff works pretty good. So.